Hello amazing people, welcome back again to my channel. So on today's video, I'll be talking about a video I saw on YouTube. So I decided to react on this video. When I say Ghana is so developed, Ghana is a country that wants the betterment of its people. When it comes to health sector, when it comes to healthcare system here in Ghana, it is top notch. I've made some videos about the health insurance scheme in Ghana and how the government of Ghana is making things so affordable for the people of Ghana. Even people in diaspora and people from other countries are coming into Ghana to get medical help or get medical assistance when it comes to any health related issues. But on today's video, I'll be sharing a particular video with you guys to watch and see for yourself how Ghana is developing, how the government of Ghana is so intentional about the people of Ghana. There is a particular company right now in Ghana that's partnered with the government of Ghana. The government of Ghana is open to partnership as long as the partnership yields positive results in the country. I saw this particular video on Wodemeyer's channel, so I decided to react on it because I was totally surprised to see such a thing as a foreigner in Ghana. This country uses drone to deliver drugs to different hospitals. Zipline partnered with the government of Ghana to launch operation in the country with a plan to introduce drone delivery service in Ahafo, Ashanti, Bono East, Central Eastern, Northern part of Ghana, the North East, the Upper East and the Volta regions, covering approximately 2,000 health facilities. When I saw this video, I was totally shocked at how the government of Ghana is so intentional about the health facilities. It is so intentional about the healthcare system of the people of Ghana. There are some countries you go to, the healthcare system is nothing to write home about. The government do not care about the citizens of that particular country. They do not care about their health. They do not care about anything that concerns them when it's health related issues. But the government of Ghana has partnered with this, con uh, this company to make sure that medications get to these most remote villages in Ghana. Those that don't have access, you know, most of these remote villages, they do not have access to the town or they cannot be able to afford coming out of town to get medical assistance. So instead of them coming out of town, spending a lot of money to come to Accra to get this medical assistance, they decided to partner with Zipline Company so they can deliver these medications with drones to these villages in the Volta region, in the northern region, in the northeastern region of Ghana. I am totally surprised seeing this because this is my first time seeing this video and I decided to react on it. And this has gave me that conclusion that Ghana as a country, the government of Ghana, is so so intentional about the people of ghana i've missed so many videos about the healthcare insurance in ghana of how the uh, nhs is so affordable for the people of ghana not only that the government of ghana has the people of ghana at heart but also the foreigners living in ghana i shared a video some months ago about myself in particular having this health insurance card and this health insurance card has helped me a lot to get medical help in ghana there are a lot of countries you go to today to get a health insurance card is so difficult to pay some amount of money to get this health insurance card and some countries you go to to get a health insurance card you have to work in the government to be able to afford to get the health insurance card but this company in ghana has partnered with ghana to deliver medications to the remote villages in ghana but before i move further if you've not subscribed to my channel please subscribe to my channel don't forget to turn the post notification to be notified whenever i post amazing content please guys watch these videos to the end watch my ads the advertisements you to place on my videos please do not skip and guys i want to share this particular video with you i saw on wodemeyer's channel about this particular company and how they partner with the government of ghana and how intentional this company and the and the government of ghana is to the people of ghana let's take a look at this video then i'll come back and react more on this particular videos watch this video guys let's go see like go ghana hello 
stop saving lives, yeah? So this I'm here massive. to save life. This is massive. This is something every country life, should emulate. <laughs> When you see something like this in a country, believe me, that particular country is functioning properly. The government of that country wants the betterment of the people, of the citizens of that country. The government of Ghana knows the need, knows how important the heart is to the individuals, to the people of Ghana. That is the reason why they decided to partner with Zipline to provide medications to the most remote villages in Ghana. That is the reason why I said I'm so so in love with this country Ghana. That is the reason why you see a lot of people coming into Ghana to come get medical assistance. And I've shared some videos in my channel about some hospitals in Ghana and I see I have so many hospitals that I'm going to be sharing to you guys to see. To tell you how Ghana is so intentional about the people and the citizens of Ghana not just the citizens of ghana but foreigners in this country when i say ghana is so developed a lot of people will come out and say ah don't tell me that ghana is look at just look at this let me share another video with you guys to tell you what the intentions of those people are when it comes to medications when it comes to health related issues in ghana guys sit tight and watch this video to the end don't forget again to like this video subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of those video turn the post notification to be notified whenever i post amazing contents like this let's take a look at the intention of ghana and zipline to the people of ghana not just to the people of ghana but to foreigners residing in ghana products products vaccines blood and other essential uh, products to hospitals all across ghana we save over 2700 hospitals in ghana wow from this is so beautiful to see through to emergency this is in ghana uh, not america this is not america this is in ghana over 2700 hospitals like i didn't mention and for us wow. this is a key concern for us so we target most of the remotest areas of ghana You've seen the video, you've heard from one of the managers, I think the manager of the zip line, what he said about the zip line, that their target is to send medications to most of those remote villages in Ghana. That is the reason why they partnered with the government of Ghana and the government of Ghana endorsed them. Can this ever happen in some other African country? The only African country that I know that is taking this step is Rwanda. Rwanda and Ghana are taking the step to see that the most remote villages in their country get this medical supply, get this medications that they cannot be able to afford. And these medications are so affordable. Zipline has made it so affordable that, oh, they do not have to pay for deliveries. They just send those medications to the hospital that needs these medications. They are saving lives. They are saving the lives of the citizens of Ghana. They are saving the lives of their brothers, their sisters, their mothers, their fathers that need these medical suppliances. So I will say kudos to the government of Ghana because they are really, really working. You know, when you are paying tax in a country and you are seeing the results of the tax you are paying, that is one of the things that will make you happy as a citizens of ghana because as a citizen you do not have access to healthcare system you don't have access to good roads you don't have access to good water supply you don't have access to good educational system there is no way you will be happy in that country there is no way you will say and beat your foot chairs that the government of that country is working but all ghanaians they know the government of ghana is working but they still want more they still want more and the government of ghana is trying to improve and see that oh they try to satisfy what the citizens of the country want i want to play this last video clips with you guys to watch and see how intentional again this government are. i will continue to say this government is so intentional because there are some countries you go to the government do not care they do not care if the citizens are living fine or not if the citizens are getting the basic amenities 
that they need. Some countries, governments do not care. But I am talking about Ghana like this because I've seen how functional the government is. I've seen how intentional the government is to the people of Ghana. And to me, I will say kudos to the government of Ghana because I am myself have also benefited from the National Health Insurance Card Scheme in Ghana. I've benefited from it. That is the reason why when I see hospitals, health uh, related issues in Ghana, I talk about it because I know how intentional the government is to the people of Ghana. Let's take a look at those last clips. Then we'll come back and react on these guys. Ministry of Health, um, the relationship that we have with the Ministry of Health is such yeah. that we actually deliver all these medications to facilities when they call on us without oh, the facilities wow. bearing any this cost. So so originally, the supply chain system is such that whenever items wow. are delivered to facilities, hmm. they pay for their right? That is it. So guys, I've come to the end of this video. See you in my next video. Bye.